Yoki. Hey, Patty. What, Agent York? Nothing. Just felt like saying that. Howdy, York.
Hey there, Mr. Yo. Hey there, Mr. Y So, we meet again, Bureau Man.
Hmm. Want to hear about all the depraved serial killers I've encountered so far? No, thank you. Forget what I said. Patty, you're getting more.
Hey, let's shout something out loud. Like what? Chocolate Sunday. Okay, sure. <gasps> Actually, never mind. This is stupid. Agent York. Yes?
This is the deep south. I feel it every time that molten hot sun pours down on me. Don't you, Zach? Yorkie. So, we meet again, Bureau Man. So, we meet again. Sometimes folks feel like drinking. One more truth bomb for you. Yeah.
You'll be back, yeah, Bureau Man. Remember, live jazz on the weekends. Yeah. So, sometimes folk, yeah. You'll be back, yeah, remember.
So, Mr. York, what do you think of my castle? Pretty cool, ain't it? I've been curious about it since the first time I saw it. <laughs> I dub it Lou Crawfish. I'll have you know, crawfish is pretty much its own food group in this town. Since this store carries all the bare necessities you'll need for daily life, I reckon it was an apt name. If it's sundries you're looking for, <laughs> there ain't much you won't find here. You ever need anything? You're not only the sheriff of this town, you also manage a general store. Sure, as long as you ring this bell here. That's terribly convenient, Melvin. But I have one concern. What if a crime occurs while you're managing the store? Running a business and keeping the peace, both jobs require immediate response in times of crisis. I just can't see how it would be possible. It's actually pretty easy, Mr. York. But what if a criminal who just robbed a bank came here on his way home and bought up all your stock? Oh, I like the sound of that. You want to make me rich? Hey, how about you just buy up the whole store while you're at it? I'll never let money stand in my way. It's not the boss of me, for I am the last shopaholic. <laughs> oh, I'm funny. Melvin, that was a serious question. Really? <laughs> Could have fooled me. Not even the Clarksons would do something that crazy. No point in preparing for something that'll never happen, right? After all, this is Lucare, the tiny forgotten town in the middle of southern nowhere. Get it, Zach? It's Occam's razor to a T. Melvin, I have to say you're a very balanced man. Now I feel confident that the Woods household will do just fine, even if you end up losing your job as town sheriff. <laughs> you sure are a joker, Mr. York. Hey there, Mr. York. Thank you. 